Hi, and welcome to the CertMic Practice Test Question of the Week, where I bring you a question that you might find on your next cybersecurity certification exam, and then explain my thought process as I answer that question. This week's question is about security information and event management systems. Let's take a look. Alex is reviewing alerts generated by his organization's SIEM, and he determines that the SIEM is generating too many false positive alerts. What parameter can Alex alter to reduce the number of false positives? Should he reduce the SIEM sensitivity? Increase the SIEM sensitivity? Reduce the SIEM capacity? Or increase the SIEM capacity? Let me give you a moment to think about that, and then I'll explain the correct answer. I release these questions once a week for members of my free CertMic study groups. There's a group covering each of the major cybersecurity certifications. If you're working on your next certification, you can learn more at CertMic.com. Adjusting the SIEM capacity would adjust the amount of information that it can process and store, rather than changing the false positive rate. So we can eliminate both of the answer choices dealing with adjusting the capacity. So to alter the false positive rate, Alex can adjust the SIEM sensitivity. If he increased the sensitivity of the SIEM, that would reduce the threshold for an alert. But reducing the threshold would increase rather than decrease the number of false positives. So we can eliminate that answer as well. That leaves us with decreasing the sensitivity of the SIEM. That would increase the threshold for an alert and decrease the number of false positives. If you found this question helpful, please click the like button below and consider subscribing to my channel for more cybersecurity content.